You look so funny. So we're at headquarters. At least I believe this is headquarters. Oh no, my battery's gonna die. Oh no. Um, but it's raining and I'm sitting in the back of the boss's car. As I'm getting my stuff out of it. Sorry, Dubs. But it's raining. It'll stop. It's been off and on. And the car kind of saved my butt. <laughs> we are at some point going to leave for the truck show. Hey, can you focus? Thank you. Ah, oh, it's Hamid. Hi, lads. Are you ready? Are you ready to go to a truck show? You're so excited. You're so full. Come here, let me show you. We have so much stuff in this truck right now. Uh, oh, like my hammer. It doesn't really belong there, it belongs on the floor, but then it got wet when we were loading it because it was raining. But are you ready? Oh. Okay, so this is what, wow, he really did put the vacuum up and out of the way. What a nice guy. Look, and we have to put another TV in here. <laughs> ah, full to the brim. Only oh, a little bit of space up front. It's so clean though. Yeah, it's so clean. They did a fantastic job. Ready to go. She's trying to get a picture of you in the truck. Oh, I'm all buckled in already. See, it's going to beep and it's going to make noises, but the display won't turn on. Another TV. Do we do? Yeah, it's gonna go up top. We have to stop at a Best Buy. That's not actually what ended up happening because we got to Dallas too late. But I'll tell you that later. Do we know which Best Buy? The one in Rockwall, Texas, which I have to pop into Tom here. Tell him that's where we're going. All right. At least I didn't mess with my mirrors. I can still see. This is the only one that's a little there. In the Freightliner, is everything motorized or? Yeah, the one that I drove, I think one of the mirrors was a little funny. All right, so where's the closest stop? He's upside down. Is he? And he's laying down. All right. At least we're just bobtailing. Oh, it's so good. We will just get green lights the whole time. I will happily take lots of those. Can I get out there? I think you can. I think I can. Watch, I'll scratch it all up. <laughs> <laughs> just got my truck all redone. Scratch, scratch, scratch. I can go around the other way too. We'll have to pull a little man out at some point, but let's go get coffee first. That's so sweet. He's upside down. <laughs> He's laying down. Come on, big guy. You can handle it. It's a bump. First ride in a truck. Well, at least that works. Oh, yeah, he works great. <laughs> That's it's mine. That I know is prime. In 900 feet, keep to the right on I-44, and then keep to the left in 0 0.2 miles. Maybe for the when I was 
starting to train, because I trained in like Fort Worth, and there were days that we would take the truck into town, like into traffic, and I was like, okay, I'm a little big, I'm not, and I, getting used to taking the turns really wide was hard, but once you get, once you start figuring out how your axle moves compared to the rest of the truck, it starts to become almost second nature. Like now I take really wide turns when I, when I drive like, with any trailer. Crossing border, entering Oklahoma. Thanks, Tom. They're merging everybody into this lane. Detour now has to wait for all of us to go through. <laughs> oh, that man. sucks. Alright, so what happened? I see one truck that I believe is on its side. You see that on the left? Yeah. And then this guy, I'm assuming, was also involved. But I've never seen a K-line to have like extra pieces hanging off of it. <laughs> Oh yeah, this is a nightmare. Oh man, it's on its side. Yeah, that one is, yes. That one definitely rolled. And I think this is pieces of it. Yeah, I think so. Look at the, the type, isn't that, um... That's one of those, the, yeah, Old Dominion. That's a nightmare. It looks 
like the rear the rear of his doubles caught and swung and it looks like he hit that truck. I don't know if he did anything to TNI. I don't know if they were involved. That looks scary, huh? That's terrifying. That tow truck looks just as terrifying though. Not this one, the other one. Ugh. I hope everybody's okay. I know. It's gonna be a while. It's definitely gonna be a while. Yep. Definitely not something we would ever want to go through, right? Right, bud? Yeah. You're just happy on your sofa, hanging out. So then it got dark. And then we arrived in Dallas. Wow, that is the coolest picture I've ever seen. That's awesome. We gotta get that printed for the office. With the, with the little, I love it. How'd you like your truck ride? I loved it. Woohoo! Hello, Dallas. Oh my goodness, that was fun. I like my parking spot. I wish I could just stay there forever. That'd be awesome. And this is our hotel. It says TS for a truck show, not really. It's late. Kirk and Haley are gonna get here before we know it. <laughs> Pretty rad. I think we should just leave it right here. It's getting enough attention as it is. You think it's safe right there? No. <laughs> we'll move it. <laughs> Can we not destroy the hotel room, please? 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 No, that's a camera. Let's not destroy that either. <laughs> <laughs> hey, can we not destroy the hotel room? Stop being adorable. Stop it. Stop being cute. Stop being cute. Hi. How are you? Huh? I need to go move the truck. You know what that means, right? Oh, he's already here. Never had a high ceiling elevator before. I'm almost done for the night. Whew. It's been a very long day. Man. Almost. Menu. Oh. So sexy. This is my view. Oh, I really is nice. Hello, buddy. I know you've been sleeping all day, and it really is. 